Hello there pizza lovers and welcome to Slice UK. It's Brad and I'm here for another Frozen Friday pizza review for you. So Frozen Friday is frozen pizza time. So what have we got for you today? First of all, let's talk about the venue. Uh, if you noticed uh, last week on the Frozen Friday, I reported directly from the floor, which uh, wasn't my best moment to be fair, but <clears throat> We work with what we've got, as I say. We're now in this new premises, uh, which is um, my partner's mother's residence. <laughs> so uh, it's always good. But um, this is where we are, and this is where we'll be going forward. Uh, so what have we got for you? We have got this. How? So this is Iceland's ultra thin margarita. Uh, wood fired and made in Italy. Right, okay. So, made in Italy, guys. It looks, I'll show you this now. Wow, that felt crisp just picking it up. It's in a bit of a Sicilian sort of style, which is, a, which is always good to see. That feels super crisp. That feels really good, actually. So, this is. Uh, Iceland luxury, as I said. Um, basically, we all know now that people's premium range or their um, authentic range is always basically means it's got fresh tomatoes and basil pesto on it. That's literally what it means. So this is no different. So let's uh, just get it cut up. I'll do squares. Make it authentic Sicilian. Um, well, that base feels good. So, yeah, this is mozzarella, just mozzarella, so really authentic. Uh, basil pesto, uh, sun dried tomatoes on top. Uh, you can pick this up for £1.75 from Iceland, so premium pie, not, not really a premium price, it's quite good that really, especially when you compare it to some of the chilled that their uh, premiums go up to like £5 and above, and the rubbish. Um, so, also, I've got here, Tony rightly said in his last video that um, we've been doing a collab with Castle Rock Brewery and he said that I wasn't doing any more because I didn't think I had any more beers left. Tony is a professional, keeps them for the videos. I just sunk one randomly, totally forgetting, but I had one left, so we'll do a little bit of a plug on Castle Rock at the end uh, to let you know what they're all about. So, let's get a slice of the action. Let's dive in on this. Okay, so there it is ultra thin base uh, I wouldn't say it's ultra thin it's um, it is thin looks good undercarriage looks really good and authentic actually it looks like a really good base this I, I'm impressed just by picking it up to be honest so right we'll go in see what it's like slice of the action okay. Tangy, first word off that, tangy, super tangy. Uh, them fresh tomatoes are really good. They give a, they give a real like boost of flavor uh, straight to you. Basil pesto, not very basil-y to be honest, it's more like oily. Do that again for you. Did you hear that crisp? That's really crisp. Goes a bit more doughy in the centre of the base, where obviously they've got the toppings, which is to be expected, I suppose, from a frozen pie. Really crisp, really nice base. Uh, is it sourdough? It's supposed to be sourdough, yeah. Yeah, you do get a hint of sourdough there with that. Let's have another go. See if we can get what this cheese is like. Bit of cheese pull, which is always good to see. Wow, that's good. That's um, a decent quality mozzarella for um, a frozen pie. The information on this box is on the, the, the thin spiny bit. What's all that about? Let's see what this sauce is meant to be. Okay, so just, wow, that's, that, I mean, this is screaming authentic right in my face. 
tomatoes, sunflower oil, basil and salt. Now if you know pizza, and you, especially if you know Neapolitan style pizza or Italian pizza, that's generally all the seasoned with is those. Okay, another crust. Oh, this is really good. I really, really like this pie. Okay. Right. Wow, I suddenly you've impressed me there. With this one. Okay, so let's score this. Um, I think the base is is really, really good. You do get the hint of sourdough, which again is really good. The tomatoes are so like tangy and give the sauce such a lift. Uh, and then you get a bit of cheese pull from the mozzarella, which is good. There's actually black pepper uh, on top as well, which you can see. And the basil pesto isn't like really basil-y or uh, we did a good fellas Romano last week where it was like almost too basil-y, like it was a bit synthetic-y. Um, that is how you do a premium pie for me. Now, Whole Creations we did was like an 8.2 and it was vegan and it was it was quality. This isn't quite there, but I'm going high with this. Uh, for look, Iceland's luxury ultra-thin margarita wood-fired made in Italy, uh, we are gonna go for a 7.7. 7.7. Uh, spinny chair. Uh, forgot about that. Extra addition to the review. I can spin for no reason. Um, seven seven. Really good score. Um, get out and get one of these. One pound seventy five from Iceland. Uh, also sell them in Iceland uh, freezer cabinets in the range. Um, not called the orange if you're uh, if you're a conspiracy theorist. Um, so that's the pizza seven seven. That's just really not me. I don't think that would be that good. Um, okay, so we'll move over to this, Castle Rock Brewery, as we've been plugging with the collab that we've done with them. Uh, this I have here is a Session, just simply called Session. There you go. Uh, artwork is cool. Like, I really like, I mean, I like most artwork on um, some craft ale companies now, but this is really contemporary. It's like proper arty. It's not just like a load of cartoon characters or whatnot and images and stuff it's a uh, really cool that pour some out in my trusty Peroni glass <laughs> that's so poor I know I apologize uh, so you can see what it looks like guess what it looks like beer uh, let's see what this one's like Castle Rock session Ooh, tangy that's uh, not too far off the tang you get from the tomatoes. Uh, yeah, really tangy, citrusy, almost like a grapefruity, grapefruity hint behind it. Yeah, that's a super, super fresh, not too like, sometimes it can be really bitter tasting. Super fresh, not too bitter. That'd be amazing on a summer's day. Uh, we've just found out in the UK that we are uh, going into stages coming out of lockdown so these would be so good sat in a beer garden in the summer uh, castle rock session definitely get onto that head over to their website where you can buy all the products uh, hit their instagram up which is really cool and they, they showcase the stuff on there as well so go and support castle rock guys really good uh, that's it from this frozen friday review uh, Tony's got a pizzeria review coming up. No, he's not. I've got a pizzeria review coming up tomorrow uh, from Northwich. Uh, so look out for that on the YouTube and on Instagram TV. Uh, other than that, new t-shirts, as you can see. Uh, we are looking to roll them out so you can buy them from the shop uh, in the future. So keep your eyes peeled for that. And remember, always stay pizzeria.